victory of the confident young Cassius Clay. One of the most unique confrontations took place a few months later, but no one realized it. Ingmar Johansson in black trunks, training to fight Floyd Patterson, went three rounds with speedy young Cassius. The upstart youngster, not knowing his proper place, boxed his way around the ring as if it were he using Ingo for a sparring partner. $100,000 cash to meet me in a national televised fight. And um, he turned it he, down. Yes, he said that the fight wouldn't draw free ticket holders and that I didn't have the ability to step in the same ring with him. So I said, well, if I didn't have the ability to fight him and he knew he was going to win and the fight wouldn't draw free ticket holders, well, why don't he come on over here, knock me out, and pick up that $100,000? Well, that's the part I don't understand. Well, Cassius, you've got a big one coming up with Mitef. What's your plan of attack? Well, uh, uh, Mitef is a good fighter. He's a strong fighter. And he has beaten a lot of good fighters. As a matter of fact, the last guy I beat by the name of Alonzo Johnson, Alec Mitef, beat him twice. And uh, it won't be an easy fight, but my plan of attack on a fighter like Alec Mitef would be two fast left jabs, a rapid right cross, and a left hook. 